Dell, America's favorite PC, right now on channel 227. If you're a Sun God 2009, here to present another video. Right here is a Dell Latitude D630, which is, as you can see, it looks kind of old, but it still runs just fine. It's running Windows 7. Um, I think it's running Windows 7 Professional, but I could be wrong. But, uh, yeah, this is a pretty good laptop. Uh, it's not the best. It is not the slowest. But it is the most amazing computer you could have. Presiding the, uh, top cover. Anyway... As you can see, it has a good um, headphone microphone jack. It has a uh, it has a uh, what is it? An express card slot. Um, I forget what this is, but it's a uh, it's a special port. I, I almost forgot. I'm not sure. I'm not awake. I'm awake to remember. But yeah. But it has a here we have a power jack, VGA, old style VGA, two USB port, modem and um, Ethernet. Over here, two more USB ports, um, a DVD ROM. By the way, they're all 2.0 ports, just like the Latitude uh, D600. I'll put it in the description below. And of course, we have also a CD burner and a DVD ROM and of course we have I believe this is a 6 cell lithium battery with a beautiful illuminating LED and yes this is refurbishing this is a refurbished computer which is not bad um, there we have a Windows XP. Come on, stupid camera, focus. Okay, here we go. We have a Windows XP product key, which it says do not use, but either way, yeah, it doesn't matter really. If you want it, that's fine. If not, oh well. This is a Windows 7 Home Premium product key, but I'm pretty sure it's not going to work because the license of this is gone. But if you want to copy it and all that, that's fine. And, and if it works for you, great to hear. I really don't care. But uh, yeah, this has a different. I, I I know I installed a different version of Windows uh, Pro, so it doesn't have Home on here. So if you guys were thinking about trying to steal the product key out of this well not gonna work good luck with that okay as you can see opening it it, lo it looks just like a regular old Dell like like the one I have upstairs and um, has the beautiful key board and a nice looking power button and a sound system and all that and there you're all your locks key locks so yep and there's also the middle blue trackpad and including the trackpad in the middle which is good this thing is running an Intel well they say it's an Intel Centrino technology but this is an Intel Core 2 Duo running at uh, I think at 2.0 gigahertz yep it's at 2.0 gigahertz running um, I, I think there's about two gigs yeah there's two gigs of RAM in here and a 120 gigabyte hard drive so uh, let's power this on the BIOS is up to date directly from the Dell's manufactured website
Oh yeah, Windows 7 Ultimate. Sorry. Yeah, I have a Windows 7 Ultimate on here. So it's not bad. It's, it's um, for those of you who want to know, it's not a 64-bit, it's a 32-bit. This computer cannot handle 6... Um, they say it handles 64-bit, but in my experience, it runs really better on the 32-bit. 64-bit is kind of pushing this thing. So I'm not going to push it any further than it needs. And, uh, yeah. Also, to um, increase performance, I had to shut off the Windows Update. As much as uh, as important as Windows Update supposed to be, I, I learned to shut them off for good because you have to also understand when you have the Windows Update service running, it actually lower it, it actually decreased the performance of your machine. You will start to notice a lot of CPU um, it, the CPU is being used. Uh, too much of the RAM is being used and it's also burning a lot on the hard drives that's all because of the Windows update and also if you have Windows Defender running I think uh, if you have an antivirus already installed on here shut the Windows Defender off I mean I, in my opinion Windows Defender is the worst worst antivirus software Microsoft has ever created if I were to use a uh, antivirus software from Microsoft it would be security essential on this machine and that would have made things a lot better. But um, I ran something else on here. It's running RoboScan. And, well, I think I vast. But other than that, you do good to stay away from... Um, you do good to turn off one of those programs. But if you, are, if you really are afraid of security issues and stuff like that, well then don't mess with them, just leave it alone, except for Windows Defender, I simply just turn that off, because it doesn't make sense, if you have an antivirus on there, why would you have another one on, I mean, it doesn't make any sense, you pretty much have an antivirus combating against an antivirus, but yeah, and I forgot the hard drive is kind of slow on this machine, but that's okay, still a good laptop, And yes, we got a couple of stuff running in the background. Yep. It's everything is like trying to take its time, is utilizing the processor I can tell the processor is heating up but uh, yeah a bit of RAM is being used too but uh, huh. not a big deal Yep, I was right. Intel Core 2 Duo, 2.0 gigahertz. Oh damn! I thought I put a uh, four. I thought there was two gigs of RAM in here. I didn't know there was four. Never mind. Uh, it still runs fine. I might have to do some tweaking with this computer, and it'll be just fine. But uh, yeah. Things are running pretty good on this machine. This is the um, newer pre predecessor versus the uh, Latitude 600, uh, D505, 500, uh, D800. Yeah, this is a, this is an improvement model of it, which is pretty good, and it also beats the Pentium M processor. Which, by the way, I am going to get that upgraded on that uh, that Dell, which I did my video review on. It is an old relic, after all, and, you know, what can I say about the old relic? Relic is relic, right? Now, to those of you who's wondering how good the sound system is on this thing, let's find out. I have never checked it, but, uh...
Let's see. You know what, I might as well unplug the battery because I mean it's been sitting in the charger for a while and I, and I don't want any more bloated, blown out uh, capacity of the battery and all that. I want it to, I'm going to give it as exercise. Give me a Hang on a minute. Here's one way we're gonna know. I'm gonna go onto YouTube and uh, play the song. I gotta get that off. Uh, let me get to get this out of the way. I'm gonna be sure to cut that out of the video, but still. Don't mind my dog. He he doesn't mean any harm. He's a he's a big boy now. If those of you who haven't seen my uh, hashtag Throwback Thursday, yeah, that's that little guy was spotty. What's the matter, buddy? What's the matter, huh? What's wrong? What are you crying for? What's what is it, boo? Yeah, that little boy is spotty. He's a good boy. All right. I'll be right with you, alright, Bubba? Just hold on a minute. I gotta take the. Let me just do this video real quick. I gotta take this dog out for a little bit so he can go do his business. And, uh, yeah, here we go. Just gonna do this one. Here we go. I'm just gonna get a sample of the music so you could hear the see how good the audio is. Uh, YouTube, please do not block this. This is just a sample. That's all it is. I just want the viewers to hear the sample of the how good the speaker is on here. Yep, that's just to go to show you how good it is. Hope I die I it is a beautiful uh, I speaker. Life seems so it's strange. not the best, but it does the job. Like Alright, that's enough. Just like life. That is pretty good. So it goes to show you that it does what it does, and and, and it's a beautiful um, machine to have. It's actually the basic computer anyone could have if they're doing, um, you know, Internet Explorer surfing and um, basic office and stuff like that. This is a this is a computer for you. Um, it's considering it, I think this is a 2006 or 2007 machine. 
this is a computer directly for you. If you need something super basic, uh, this Dell is the way to go. Uh, and uh, I am pretty adamant uh, this thing will probably do very fine. Well, not very fine, but it will do fine with uh, Windows 10. Uh, I wish I have an extra one of these I could use to run Windows 10 on, but uh, oh well, you can't have everything now, can you? But uh, let's see, let's see how well the battery life is since I was on YouTube. Eh, it's, it went from 192, so the battery life is alright on a 6 cell lithium battery. At least it beats the uh, other predecessor where um, the battery on that Dell uh, D600 I heard it would last up to, uh, uh, what is it, 600, uh, I'm sorry, 30 minutes? Yeah, I'm pretty sure the battery life on this thing will, this battery life if I remember, lasted only up to an hour or so um, and I'm gonna tell you it is an improvement versus the D505, the D500, D600 and D600 and the uh, other predecessor but um, yeah that's all you need to know about this that's all you need to know about this video uh, I hope you enjoy this video I hope you enjoy the review of this Dell uh, D6, uh, see, D630. If you have any questions, leave it in the comment below. If you wish to subscribe to my channel, hit the subscribe button. Um, also, don't forget, oh yeah, if you like this video, hit the like button, of course. Don't forget to subscribe to my friend Doki Say Toxic. Wolf, and never miss another video. Alright. Bye bye. All right, boo. Hold on. I'm gonna take you out. I'm gonna take you out.